Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. And how are you doing today? I'm doing fine and thank you for asking. <laughs> okay, so finally both of the boxes are in. You know, I've been waiting for this for a while and they have never both came at the same time, but they did today. And what are they? You already know our boxy char so today we've got the premium and the luxe um i will leave in the description box below how much uh, these boxes cost plus what was the value inside of both of them of course we already know what's inside the premium box because they've already discussed that it's only one uh product only or not one product only but you know one company only which is the Fenty, so we're just going to wait to open the Fenty box. But without further ado, we're just going to jump right into the video. Okay, so we are going to do our BoxyCharm Lux. Now, I've already snapped both of these boxes open, so it would not take long to, uh, you know, just open them up and show you guys. So you're going to get the first sneak peek or the first look of the box. And there we go. BoxyCharm Lux. And... Um, this one is pretty edgy, and it looks like I've got variation number three right here, and here's everything that's going to be in the box um, with the prices. Um, I know some people were mad because of the packaging, and some of them didn't get their cards again, uh, but I did get my card this time, and I can understand what they mean by the packaging because I know you guys seen it, but... Really? Really, BoxyCharm? Come on, you guys can do way better than that. Paper, like, it looks like it's, it's, it's nothing to protect. So, I'm a little upset about that. Okay, so, what we got was the BoxyCharm uh, palette, which I'm not happy about this. Sorry, BoxyCharm. I would have loved to have had the Tarte or the Hank and Henry, but... I'm not excited about your palette at all. I'm just going to be very, very honest about that. Um, but yes, here is the palette. Here are the colors. Now, they are very pretty. I just would have loved to have somebody else's. I'm not going to swatch these right now, but uh, this is the palette. So this is exactly what the palette looks like out of the box of the packaging. So yes, it says, Hello Charmer. Which, hello, Boxy. <laughs> uh, so, yes, this is one item. And that item actually goes for $39. So, if you want to keep track of how much everything is, go right ahead. Okay, it looks like the next thing we got was blush. That's all it says is blush. Like, really? Like, what company is this? It says it's soft pink. Um, I'm guessing it's Elizabeth Mott, because that's the only thing on here that I'm seeing, uh, because it says, show me your cheeks, so, yeah, it's the blush, it's by Elizabeth Mott, which I would have loved to have actually had the name on there, other than just blush, or show me your cheeks, so, um, yeah, I don't know about this product, but we are, we're definitely going to test everything out like we always do. Um, let me see. Let's open this up. Let's see what she actually looks like. Because she might be a good product while I'm sitting here talking crap. Um, okay, so this is the product. And, yeah. Um, I don't know. It's pretty, but how does it apply is, you know... 
what we're looking for. So that's that product. And this one goes for $23 that it says. Okay, and then next we've got uh, two, it looks like of the same thing, uh, the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream and Coco Cabana Cream. So the small ones. And these go right here for, let's see, I've got two of these, so $15 each. So I guess each would be 15 or they're both 15 together. I'm not quite sure. They did not specify on that. But yeah, I'm just, I've never tried this before. So I have no idea what to expect. Some people say it's good. Other people said it was a waste of money. It smells freaking awesome, though. Oh, oh my God. Oh, I love coconut. I swear to God, I love coconut and cocoa. Whatever it is. Okay, and then this one isn't even all that full. You see that? Like, that's how this one came. Versus this one. Like, are you kidding me? So, um... I don't know if somebody actually didn't know what they were doing or what happened because, oh, I don't want to move my light, but tapping it all the way down, there's still only that much in there. So, and it smells the same as the other one. Um, yay, <laughs> I guess, uh, okay. Um, so our next item, of course, is what they already said that every Lux member was getting was the PMD, and this one goes for $99. Now, do I really think it's $99? I don't know, because of last month's uh, item that we got, said it was $100, and I did do research on it, and I am doing a separate video on that later on. I did find some stuff out which was not good. So, uh, I don't know if this actually works, works. Oh, it sent me a battery. Oh, shit. Okay. So, this is what it looks like, and it, it'll actually stand up, I guess. This is fixing to come off. That's why you heard that. Um, but, I guess I would have to actually put the battery in it first <laughs> to see how it works. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. Actually, you know what? We'll do that another time because I'm trying to make this video really short. We're already at seven minutes. So yes, this is another one of the items. And I actually like the color of this. But we will try it out. We will see how it works. And last but not least, uh, we what the fuck is this? A, a hair tie? Crystal... Really, BoxyCharm? Are you are you serious? Okay. So, this one is for $8. Who would, in their right mind, wants this crap? I, uh, I'm just, uh, I'm a little upset, guys, at this box. Their hair, this would get, like, stuck in your hair. Your hair would wrap around these, pull out. Like, who the freak would want this? Okay, I'm, I don't care if it was $8. I would never pay for something like this. But if you're happy about that, more power to you. That's going in the trash. Okay, our next item we got, which I already knew I was getting, was the Appeal Gel Liner in Cheek, Cheek, Chick. Um, and then this one right here goes for $21. Um, we will definitely try it out. It says it's a gel liner. So, hey, we got a different color. I'm actually not too happy about the color, but, you know, it is what it is. Whatever. Let's move on. We've got the Sutra Curling Iron. I already knew I was getting this. This is a new one. Okay, so, yeah, I'm not mad about this. I'm happy that I actually got the Sutra not mad at it at all because it was an item that I did choose and it's a mini wand so it's going to do smaller tighter curls and I like my other one so I have a feeling I'm going to like this one too so I can take definitely 
smaller sections and do smaller, tighter curls with it. So I'm not mad about this item. I'm actually happy I got it and that they actually send it to me. One item I'm happy about. So last in our box is, ooh, NARS. Okay, and this NARS is going for $20, $25. And the color that I got was warm leatherette. I don't know what color that is. It doesn't have like a shade color. Ooh, so that's pretty. Ooh, okay. That's a pretty color. I like that. I would so rock that. So that's real pretty. Mmm. Has a good smell, too. So, this was everything that was in my Lux box. Um, the only thing, items that I'm happy about that I can actually say are these three items. Everything else, mm, I'm not happy about them at all. Uh, so, it is what it is. You know, beggars can't be choosers, I guess. Uh, only for the items that they actually let you choose. Which I hate that they only let you choose, like, one or two items for the Lux. When they should let you choose every item, but I don't work for the company, so it is what it is. Okay, so we are on to Fenty. Yes, the Fenty box. A lot of people were not happy about getting this box either, which I don't know why, because I wanted to buy um, Riri's products, but I have never gotten around to it. And I'm actually happy that they actually did a box featuring her. So I'm super happy about this. Um, let's see, the first item that I received in this box was Matchstick, and in the cunnel, cunnel, in the color Unicorn, which it looks like it's a purple color, and I'm not mad about that. I've seen a lot of people were getting this, and they were mad about it being purple, and I'm like, oh, who cares, like, Jesus, but let's see, ooh, you just rub it on. That's actually really pretty. You could probably use that for like an eyeshadow though. That's probably what I would use it for was like a shadow and maybe sometimes as a highlighter, but that's super, super pretty. I like that. Thank you, Riri, for this. I do appreciate it. And I guess Boxy Charm. Um, okay, so we all know we were getting the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna, the palette. And ooh, these colors are freaking gorgeous. And I love that they're all out in diamond shapes. Even though it would really be square, but turn it diamond. Um, so let's go ahead and open her up and let's actually see what they look like in person. So let's open this up. And oh, oh, okay, okay, all right. So here is the packaging. Super stunning, super cute. I love her packaging. Um, can I get it open though? Oh, okay. And, ooh, oh, they're so much more prettier in person. Where's my card? So, this is what the colors look like. Yes, honey. Oh, um, my eyes went straight to this green and this one and then that blue. Oh, so pretty. We are definitely going to do some looks with this. So, I am happy about getting that as well. Our other item that we got was the Kilowatt Highlighter. And Trophy Wife, which I think everybody got this highlighter right here. I don't think there's any other ones. If there is, leave that in the comments below. I mean, oh, it fell right out. So, I would definitely use this for a highlighter. And I would definitely, definitely use it for just like an eyeshadow. Ooh, it comes with that little plastic thing on top. So, ooh, super pretty. Let's swatch it. It's so soft, too. Real soft. Ah, one swipe. Oh, all three of those colors like go together so well. Super pretty. Like that. Thank you, Riri. And I'm going to wipe that on my leg. Um, okay, so we've got three other products. We've got the Invisimat, which is the blotting, which I have really oily skin. Um, so this is actually going to help me out a lot um, through the day of just blotting it. So this is the packaging. There's the papers right there that you would stick in here, which I'm not going to do that right now. And it's got a mirror. So I'm super, super happy about this. Cannot be mad about it. I love it. 
Okay, our next item is the Gloss Bomb. Yes, and Diamond Milk, which I think everybody got the same one as well. I think the only things that were going to be different would have been your highlighter and the lipstick. So here is this. Ah, the packaging is stunning. Really, really pretty. Ooh. Mmm, I can't even... I can't even think of the smell of it, but oh my gosh. Super glossy. Time is fixing to run out, guys, so I'm going to have to start this again. Okay, so my video, my whole thing is going short of memory and stuff, so this is super cute. I like this. Um, and last but not least, we've got the matte and... Griselda. Oh, I like that name. It's a really pretty color, it looks like. I don't know if it's a brown. It looks like a brown. I want to say it's a brown. Ooh. So there's the packaging. Super stunning. Okay, I opened it the wrong way. Oh, yeah, so it's like a brown red. You know what? Just for fun. Just for shits and giggles. Um, let's go ahead and actually shade this one on our lips. I just want to see what it looks like and if I'm actually going to like the color. So, let's go ahead and apply that. Oh. Oh, it's a purple. It's like a red. Purple. Mm, like a Selena kind of color. It's a little dark. I would definitely have to use a pencil for this. To actually line right. But I don't think it's matte. But super cute. Yeah, so it's a red. You can tell. It's already running to the side. So I would definitely have to use a liner with this. Uh, but yeah, ooh, made my teeth look even whiter. So that was everything in my Fenty box. You know what? Just because, let's go ahead and see what this gloss looks like over it. Because the gloss is stunning right there. So, let's see what this gloss would look like over this. Oh. My gosh. Yes. Oh, and it stained it. Let me wipe that off. Because so I don't want it to go in and then mess up the color. So, yeah, but anyways, okay, so this was everything that was in my boxes. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you are an old subscriber of mine, thank you, beautiful, for joining me. I really do appreciate it, and if you are a new subscriber of mine, thank you, beautiful, for joining BBK family. We do appreciate it over here on this side, and if you are not a subscriber of mine, what are you waiting for? Hit that notification down below and hit that subscribe button so you're not missing anything that I upload in the future. But we're going to go ahead and sign this video out, and I will see you guys back with another video on testing all these products out. Bye.